and uh, I give uh, uh, the floor to uh, Nobel Prize winner, professor of the Department of Innovation in uh, Biologic in Biological Science uh, to Ricardo Valentini. That was reflected by Argentina traditional producers. And we also have land area that are covered with green, where the situation is developing nicely. These are the Russian Federation, Canada. These are reaching with favorable climate where productivity and production of agricultural products can be improved. So those countries will become the leading producers and there'll be regions that have better opportunities than others. That is the situation. And here we have to develop new mechanisms for establishing new links and development on the international markets. And the Russian Federation also have wonderful opportunities for establishing its foothold on this market. And we already know that we have some indicators reflecting climatic changes in Russia. And we know that here, the average annual temperature has been gradually increasing in the past 40 years, my colleagues told me that it's now real frosty and Moscow, a lot of snow. You know, Moscow covered with snow, that is beautiful. So in some terms, we go a little bit back in time. Nevertheless, in the future, we'll have increasingly more issues related to
and you can collect them in Moscow or in Rome and then evaluate the parameters of growth and ripening or whatever and control those possible fertilizer treatments. You can decide when and how to use those agents, how to control irrigation systems and everything. All this expression, new technologies that are controlled remotely and we can really apply them in very remote areas. All this can be connected to this system of radio signals. Undoubtedly, all technologies are engaged in artificial intelligence, data processing, everything is there. And here I'd like to wrap it up, my brief presentation. I do apologize if I've taken a little bit more time than was given to me, but I'm so happy to participate together with you in this forum. And it will be very interesting for me to continue collaboration in the field of research because we have such a long established links personally with me in Russia, between Italy and Russia, and it's a very good example of successful collaboration between the two countries. And as Pavel mentioned, there are going to be more and more opportunities for business where they can do some more specific project. And this is exactly when the entire mankind should go together in order to ensure food and nutrition for everybody. And in this context, the agriculture, the role of agriculture became essential for the humanity. Thank you so much for the attention. And I'd like that uh, when everything will settle, the, we're going to have a meeting in Moscow. Thank you so much, Professor Valentin, for this very interesting report, very concise introduction to our forum. 